Hey there friends, Nibs again. Out at the range today doing a little bit of planking, a little bit of shooting. And I wanted to do an installment for the day at the range, Thanksgiving day challenge. <clears throat> Thanksgiving challenge. And uh, Eli's proposed, I can show you. Eli over at dayattherange.com has proposed a new target. A little bit different, a uh, little bit different uh, layout. A little bit different rules, so keep things interesting and keep us on our toes. <laughs> but uh, we have uh, six target turkeys and then a one spotter. And the one, this one up here is a one pointer. Then we have two two pointers, two five pointers, and a 15 pointer. This 15 pointer is about the same size as the flies we were shooting at in the day at the range fly swatter challenge. So not impossible to hit, but uh, <laughs> Still a pretty difficult challenge. Uh, what I brought out here to do this uh, attempt with is a really cool rifle from my collection. This is uh, one of two Winchester 52 C's that I own. Uh, and this particular one, the other one is a civilian model, but this one is actually US property marked and uh, it has is topped with a a Nurdle 12X uh, Ultra Varmint Scope. And one, one of the interesting things about the Ultra Varmint Scope is uh, most of Nurdle scopes were a three quarter inch tube. This one actually has a two inch bell and a full one inch diameter tube. So you get a little bit better light gathering capability on it. But uh, this one is only a 12X. So that little tiny, uh, that little tiny turkey at 50 yards is gonna be a challenge. But uh, I'm shooting it with the uh, Wolf Match. Uh, I've got other ammo I could shoot, but uh, I bought several bricks of this stuff, so, and uh, most of my guns are really liking it, so I'm just uh, keeping on using it and not using up the other stuff that I have in stock. Um, I only have a single shot tray in here. I do have a I do have magazines I can put in here, but I only have the single shot tray out here with me. So, but uh, we get uh, up to 10 shots, ciders and everything. So I'm gonna skip the ciders and I'm gonna go right for the one, the one pointer and use that as my cider. And uh, I think that's a better strategy than trying to make sure we're on target with the cider. Uh, nothing in the rules say we have to shoot a cider, <laughs> but, uh, It is, uh, it is gonna be a challenge. So this tire, this is a very, very clear scope, very fine crosshairs, but uh, all right, let's, uh, let's see what we can do. One pointer. All right, got the one pointer. A little to the right on them, so we'll have to keep that in mind when we're. So once you've hit one, that one's already on the table. No more shooting at that particular one. So we'll move on to the uh, the two pointers. Got that two pointer again, just a little to the right. So I think uh, there's going to be a lot of uh, a lot of perfect scores on this one. I can predict, and it's going to come down to who did it in the least amount of shots. Ooh, I think I. I hit him on the foot, that, that counts. He said hitting the sign doesn't count, but it, any other part of the turkey counts. So I hit that one on the foot. All right, let's move on to the five pointers. Ooh, I think I got him on the foot. All right. 
once it looks, once I think I've cleared them all, as long as I haven't used up all my bullets, I'll walk down there and, and see if there's any actual misses. And uh, oh, there's one miss. I know that I hit the sign. I think on that one. All right, got five more to hit the last two. That was a weird flyer. All the rest of them have been hitting low and right, and that one hit high and right. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Okay, I think I got them that time. I just cracked them on the right-hand side. All right, I got three bullets left to hit the 15-pointer. Can I do it? <laughs> he is tiny in this little 12X scope. Ooh, I think I got him. All right, I have two shots left. So I'm going to pause the camera and I'll walk down there and make sure it looks like I've cleared them all, but uh, I want to make sure before I, I call myself the victor, <laughs> but stand by. Alrighty, I am back and uh, I do believe that the five pointer on the right hand side, uh, I may have cracked into the body, but I don't think so. I don't have a... I don't have a bullet checking gauge with me, so we're going to go ahead and shoot these last two or last one or two at uh, that one again and uh, hopefully uh, clear that one this time. Okay. Oh yeah, got him that time. All right, so now I'm clear with one bullet left. So I'm gonna expend this last bullet at the spotter and then we'll get on out of here. Good shot on the spotter. All right, very good. <laughs> Go ahead and uh, check out dayattherange.com and uh, you can download these targets over there and give this a try. It is not easy. Uh, this is a great shooting gun, and uh, it still took me all but one shot to, to get it cleared. So, but uh, there you go. Another, uh, another 30 for, uh, for old nibs. <laughs> Hope you guys liked the video. Until next time, have a great day.